It's a new dawn. A new day for the Guam Sea Hick. We landed on Cooper Island in Palmyra Atoll after a 14-hour journey from Wichita, Kansas. The Nature Conservancy, which owns the island, held signs along the runway welcoming the Sea Hick. They must feel at home here if they're already eating the minute they get here. It was a, a long journey for them, so it's definitely surprising that they ate, but they must feel like this is home. The birds were placed in temporary tents overnight. On Friday morning, history was made. The Guam Sihik were released one by one into aviaries spread across the island before their eventual release into the wild. The release isn't happening uh, today. We have the, we just put them in their release aviary, aviaries and then we will give them um, probably about a week at least to kind of get settled, get used to the environment, uh, make sure they're eating uh, and then make sure they're eating live food. They need to learn um, or at least we need to make sure that they're um, dispatching their own live prey that's crawling in and out of the aviaries. Once we know that they're doing that, they'll get a quick health exam and then we'll attach backpack transmitters to them. Um, as soon as they're settled after that, then we can go ahead and open the doors. And that could be different days for different individuals. So we're definitely just taking it at whatever pace the birds tell us they're ready. KUAM News had the opportunity to release the last of the nine birds into the aviary. It was an emotional moment for everyone involved working on the project for years. I feel very emotional that, you know, these birds are, are coming to a place that's just like their home. It's very much like Guam here. And this is the next step towards coming home to Guam. It's a, an emotional moment for me. Uh, it's something that's been years in the works, um, only possible because you know, Palmyra poses such a, a low risk to these birds. Um, it's such a well-studied ecosystem, um, so we were able to bring them here responsibly and ensure their safety. Um, it's a very important step towards seeing them return to Guam finally. And um, yeah, it's just a really happy occasion, even though I'm crying. Um, and yeah, I just have so much hope for these individuals um, and then for the species as a whole. And the birds will now settle in to their new home. They are seem to be accumulating really well to, to their new habitats. A new habitat that they once thrived in. The sea hick will have so many other bird friends here. Uh, just to be, be in the wild like they were born to be. It's a shared hope by many for the Guam Sea to one day fly in the wild again on Guam. Tomas Manglonia, KUAM News, Palmyra.